Another vlogging day, another holiday shopping. Check out Ontario Mills. All right, just gonna search around to see if there's anything that I like to find or something. Also, yes, there's also GameStop right there, except that I have nothing in particular that I like. This is actually the whole food court around this place. There's another Japanese food restaurant, actually. It's a fast food right there. It's different, unlike Westminster Mall. Still, there's a lot of phone repairs, and they also have furniture stores here. It looks like this store will be closed down pretty soon because they discount way too much, and they say everything must go sale. I guess they fall for bankruptcy. Here's another restaurant right there, Yongkang Street. Although I only ate dumplings here. Here's the same ass scam machine with fake dollar bills. Let's just shop around five below then. Here's some toys right there. Of course, there's at least one Sonic toy called Egg Shot with Sonic the Hedgehog. It looks like we got some phone accessories right there. Everything that they have and there's even some the gears that they have for most of the auto stuff. All right, nothing else to spend here inside, so I'll be finding another store then. So right now, the next uh, place to visit inside this mall is Days Buster. All right, so these arcade games are pretty much similar to where I visited John's Grill Pizza. However, I'm currently only sticking to one at a time here because I don't want to register Days Busters yet. Although I would like to at some other point in time, I'm not definitely sure. But these arcade games are pretty much identical to what I've seen in John's Grill Pizza. And yes, you had to use credits to play. to pay to win the tickets game, I assume. Okay, that was it in Dave's Busters, so let's see if we can go there. I mean, just go to different places, such as Dezo. The other one is Chrono Toys. I guess I really needed a new iPhone case for my phone, because this side's been eaten up and it's been wearing out a lot already, so I guess I'm gonna buy one. All right, finally, just got only the new phone case because my old one's gonna rip and die. This Reinforced Cafe reminds me of going to an amazing park such as Universal Studios, Knott's Berry Forum, Disneyland, or any other general places. That's a freaking gator right there on water. It's actually a fake alligator. Here is the other section. This one looks more like a crane to grab as many plushies. There's another gift shop right there, but I'm just gonna only check for a bit, just not as much, so I'll be back. All right, here's Build-A-Bear workshop right there. <laughs> uh, Perry, I originally tried doing a vlogging episode for me getting Sonic and Tails plushies. Apparently I didn't have enough time to do it, so I'll just try to add in a rewind of how I got the plushies. Alright. 30? 60. You guys getting those uh, plushies? Same. I'm a Sonic fan too. Okay, now how do I get this scanner to work? Oops. I make this look good! Oh, I'm getting a chip. Everyone calls me too. You're probably wondering why. Oh. You found everything okay? Yeah. Okay. Have you seen the movie already? Yeah, I already seen the movie. Was it good? Yeah. Yeah. And then you 
to fill it and just tell me if you want to put more or even take out some. Okay? See? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Sound test? Yeah. Go ahead and see if it's loud enough. If not, I can move it a little bit so Alright, here it comes. Okay, go ahead. And then how does Sonic feel? Yep. Have you been a fan of Sonic for a while? Yeah, for a while. Yeah? Yes. When did you get into them? Uh, ever since I was very young. Oh yeah? Yeah. That's cool. I know, I used to be into them when I was younger too. Got it. How's that feel? Alright, thanks. Yeah. And I put to the first. What do we name them? Mm -hmm. Sonic and Tail? Yeah. Repeat. You pay $5 for it, but it has that balance of 10 and you can use it starting tomorrow. Uh, no thank you. No worries, 8507. 8507, okay. Yeah. And that's the story of how I got my plushies from Bill the Bear. So as of now, Tails is out of stock, but Sonic recently got restocked a while ago. So there's enough time to them trying to buy Sonic. Just gotta dig through what I purchased, but I finally got the Sonic shoes and rings for my Sonic plushie. All right, the rest, still searching for random things. The only stores I see across are just some generic clothing, shoes, and some other furnitures, and even accessories too. I'm just gonna skip through all these because I don't find anything that I like inside the store. Look at that, people can take pictures near Santa Claus. We got some decorations right there too, as well. That's a lot for a Christmas wish. Another scan machine. Ooh, never seen that restaurant before. They recently opened up Chicken Burr Spaghetti, Jolly Bee. And what's the deal today? New and improved Jolly Spaghetti. A little bit of posters right there too. <laughs> Singapore, New York, Royal Joy, Philippines, Dubai, California, Milan, London, Vietnam, Hong Kong, Brunei, and almost every city. So of course I did finally order this cheap spaghetti, jolly spaghetti, which starts at $6.49, but I paid for an extra treat for $7.99. Alright, here's my order that I got. I got my Pepsi and they gave me a fork and a napkin for my spaghetti. I actually love this so far. <gasps> Let's see if I can take a picture of mm, this food. Alright, enough talk. Let's see how this tastes. Got to roll up like this. Yes, I love it. Plain spaghetti. Whoa, it's a lot of hot, hot. Come on. Yes, I love it. I love it. Now let me finish the rest of the food. Brilliant. <laughs> Finally done with everything. Drink all of it and all that. Let's just throw it away now. These prices look sketchy already. <gasps> All of them, basically. All right, almost done here. Just, uh, this is the last section. All of that too. Play any music that anyone wants to play. This section has a lot of instruments too. Oh my God, I, I should take up this entire slot already. <gasps> okay, I guess that's pretty much everything inside already, so. Stay tuned to the next one. I'm just gonna be leaving Ontario Mills for a sec. Holy shopping number two, Victoria Gardens. Here's the big ass Apple store right there too in Victoria Gardens. Still vlogging around in several Victoria Garden shops, but I have nothing to showcase around here because most of them are pretty much clothing stores and some other electronic products. Etc. I love the smooth watery fountain right there. <laughs> Look at that. Visual effects. Completely clean water flow. Some other stores are pretty much the entire restaurant, etc. Okay, so this place is actually the food court inside Victoria 
Gardens. Unfortunately, I already ate it at Antero Mills, so I don't have to get food here. Feels much like browsing through Pomona Valley. I mean, if you want to check out Pomona Antiques Row, then check out my reboot mini vlog here. Overall, this is a center in Victoria Garden Balls with a huge Christmas tree. And look at the train right there too. These shops right now are pretty much insane. Yes, it is insanely big. I'm right there. And the whole thing is just a whole mess. So it's pretty much too many to visit. There's a bit more to explore around here still. I guess I actually remember taking a picture here, but it's been a while ever since I visited there. Still nothing particular at the other side of Victoria Garden Malls. Oh my goodness, there's cactus right there too. Oh wow. It's easy. <laughs> I love pushing these automatic wheelchair buttons. Take the escalator upstairs. Yeah, I just got too distracted, but there's some toys inside Macy's right there. Everything. All right, I'm in the section of there. I'm not sure what clothes to wear, but uh, just the display only. Yeah, that's so how I was walking around during Macy's. They gave me two samples for men and women, but I can only try a sample for men. If anyone can read it carefully. Let's see. Looks good, okay. This sample, I guess it smells nice, but it's meant for just hair, not um, to where I put it anywhere, but um, at least it do smell a bit nice, even though I'm not wearing the proper clothes. I'm just a casual guy just walking around and pretty much plain clothing. Because I prefer to wear shorts and small t-shirts. So far this section is pretty much entirely clothing only, but I have nothing in preference, so I'm gonna take downstairs. Enough of all that. Let's just go somewhere else. <laughs> There's another Macy's store right there. All the way across from here to here. Obviously, yes. <laughs> Staying for way too long already. I still have nothing else to search around here, so maybe I could continue on or if there's nothing else going. I love the smell of the small river right there in Victoria Gardens. Take a look at everything that they have already. Although this is the same area that I already entered. I guess I'm back to where I started already, but uh, eh, let's just explore around for a little bit. Here's another one with uh, a historical figure pouring a vase of water. Okay, I'm done exploring around. Although there's nothing else particular going on around this place, but thank you all for watching my video. If you guys enjoy my content, please consider following me on other social media platforms. This is Fog Reality TF, signing out. Forgot to make some recording here, but <laughs> I finally put on my Sonic plushie with rings and the shoes. All of those shoes are a lot difficult to tighten up. Same thing for my new iPhone case, which I had to take out this plastic cover right there, put on the phone, and then put the plastic cover back. And that's it.